what you doing? Ah, no, down! Hey guys, Budget Girl here, and today is garden planting day. My compatriots are driving up right now, that's them. And we went to Lowe's where we got our plants. We, um, we're doing this a little late and we probably spent a little more money than we had to but since we're splitting it I guess we both decided we could spend a little more. This is what we got. We got uh, two basil plants with three plants each in them. Some cucumbers because Sean wants to make pickles. Four strawberry uh, not strawberry. We already had three strawberry plants that are going in the garden. Um, four tomatoes and six peppers. Six different kind of peppers. We could have gotten six packs and saved a little money, but it would have been six banana peppers, six hot peppers. Instead, we have uh, all these different kind of plants that we'll get to experiment with. So we're going to go out and do that. And the cost was $55.61, which I split with the lovely Lindsay, and uh, we also got some twine. So soon you'll see how we built, how we are laying out our square foot garden. All right. Uh, hey guys, Budget Girl here with my gardening compatriots, Sean, Lindsay, and Rory. I don't know what Rory thinks she's doing, but this is our little garden. Well, it will be. Uh, it's as you can see, it's on a plot with five other little gardens, and these back here are worm beds. These are the stripped bamboo poles I showed you guys after I hacked them down. And we're going to make a tomato cage with them. I already have some strawberries in the ground that I got from Vincent Best House. Rory is eating weeds. Stop it. Stop it. Alright. And we're about to start digging in. It'll be fun. Do you have anything to say? Hey guys, alright, so we have planted my garden and I just kind of interspersed these. I've got the tomatoes on the corners and the peppers through and the ones in the corner, like this is kind of angled to grow up this stake, as you can see. Uh, and now what we've done is dug a little hole all the way deep. These were eight foot poles and now they're closer to probably about seven feet because this is one foot deep bed. We dug a hole stuck it in there and then just like shrunk it down and what we're going to do is tie them cross and then tie them long way making a kind of a tent this is a tomato tent and I'll show you guys what it looks like in a second all right so since the um, bam all, I cut all the bamboo long enough to be tall we had to uh, basically estimate and one of us held it up I wanted and the other cut it or just marked it with Sharpie and then Sean used his mighty hatchet to hatchet them down and now we're going to tie everything together just with twine. Go. So before it starts torrentially downpouring, as you see here we have built our tomato tent. Um, the twine going across it is going to be growth support for our tomatoes and our peppers um, so they'll be able to latch on and grow up tall. Um, we have some additional stakes in the ground for some of the other ones that might not be as close to the twine. And um, we probably need to get going because the rain's picking up. <laughs> Stay dry, guys. <laughs> guys, look how pretty my garden is. Like, you can see it. It looks like a mad science experiment there among all the other beds. <laughs> uh, I hope you're having a great day.